Hello YouTube, welcome to a new Let's Play, and uh, today we're going to be playing uh, Castle of Illusion, starring Mickey Mouse, and you already knew that by uh, looking at the thumbnail and the title of the video before you click it, so uh, yeah, I've been playing this one for the past couple of days, <laughs> I think this is this is another uh, a Gen Mega Drive title that you can just play over and over again, you can complete it once and then I can play it through again gladly, so yeah, I've been playing that this one a lot and I've been playing the Sega Master System version but I, I prefer this one the, um, the Master System one I can't complete it's too hard this is the uh, the clunky Master System platforming so yeah the, I'm letting the storyline open up and, and uh, Minnie Mouse has been taken by the witch Miserable and uh, Mickey's got to save the day so we're heading over to that castle right there so this title, Castle of Illusion, starring Mickey Mouse. So let's do what it says on the screen. Let's press start. I did try this on hard mode, and it's fucking. I can't do it. <laughs> I can get to the toy level when it gets a bit. It gets on. It gets too uh, hectic for me. I can't handle what's going on on the screen. So yeah, hurry up before Miserable uses her powers of illusion to make herself look like Minnie and make Minnie look evil like her. So. You must find the seven gems of the rainbow. They will give you the power to overcome Miserable. But be careful. The gems are protected by the Master of Illusion. Oh, really? Okay. We've got the, the toy soldiers. But they can't do much to us. Bop, bop, bop. So off we go. We're in the castle. We're going to go and tackle the first level. So yeah, we've got to go through each of these doors. So this is the first level. What kind of room is behind this one? And uh, like most platformers of the old days, they kept the trend of having a grassy green theme stage, which I like. So yeah, here we are. You can jump, and you can bop, and that's pretty much that's, that's all there is to it. Just basic platformer. As I say in all my Let's Plays, that's what I like. I love platforming. Um, I did watch a YouTuber the other day, or yesterday, but by the time this video gets up, it was probably a couple days ago, uh, Kaz Xena, she's, she's done a video saying about games that she can't get on with, and she mentioned platformers, <laughs> and she's just recently subscribed to me as well, so, so yeah, <laughs> it's strange, uh, some people don't like, it's strange isn't it, what games that people like, like some can't do platformers, some can't do shooters and RPGs. I'm a bit of an all-round gamer. I can play all all types of games, really. But platforming is my favourite. It's what I do best. Yeah, the RPGs are okay, so they take long. I can't pick. I can't play any RPG. It's got to be a specific one. I've got to really get into it and enjoy it because of the story shit and the control schemes. Not really for me. I'm not gonna like it, am I? So, but yeah, I've played a couple RPGs. I've done Shining Force. And I've done well, Shining Force 1 and 2, and I've done uh, Secret of Mana, I've done that recently. Uh, what else have I done? Uh, Paper Mario, I've done that. And uh, I attempted Final Fantasy 8 years ago when I was like, a teenager, I couldn't really get on with that. I, I think I was too young for those sort of games, but now I'm a bit older, I'm, I'm going to go back to them one day. Final Fantasy. So yeah, I ain't said much about uh, <laughs> Castle of Illusions, have I? So we've just done the first section of the level one, and now we're in the spider web. I hope there ain't no flickering, because when I when I was trying to record this earlier, my first couple of attempts, oh, I kept getting flickering, and it wasn't the cartridge because I cleaned that, and uh, it was flickering on the dazzle screen, but not on my TV screen. So I don't know what's going on there. I think my dazzle was on its way out. I could get another one. They're quite cheap in name, Dazzles. Oops, not doing very well. Oh. Ah, fucking hell. Shouldn't be uh, failing now, we're only in the first level. <laughs> there, we're on the third the third phase, and it's gonna get uh, gonna get creepy. Ooh. What's going on here? Miserable's made them the place go to night time. Oh, let me jump over there. Yeah, the, the ghosts are out. The ghosts and goblins are out to play. Oh well. 
They can't do damage to my backside, can they? <laughs> so yeah, there's a few goodies up here, like a se secret, a secret, the um, them gems. They count towards your secret bonus at the end of the the level. If you if you're going for like a high score, so we're gonna go down here. It's a bit, it's a shortcut. Well, the up, the up, the up, what at the um the top level is the secret shortcut. But I think going down this way is even quicker. Oh, yeah, I thought we were going to go down too soon. Get rid of the uh, mushrooms. They look like jelly beans, don't they? They're like glowing blue, aren't they? Oh, take you out. So I come around here. Them little stars, they, they, they're your health me. So every time you pick one of them up, it'll increase one dot on your health. Right, now we can exit the level. Let's go. We should be on the boss, the first boss. Like log peaks. If you're doing this on hard mode, it's easy. To, it's the, the little ac the acorns that drop down, they're in more harder to harder places to dodge. Like they, you get more more come down at once. Yeah, but yeah, you don't have to just pop on them. You can use your um, yeah, like that. Use your uh, projectile, your little apples. But I think uh, bopping on it with your backside, I think that does more damage. Yeah, when I've done this, uh, this, this boss, that'll be the end of the video. So because it's a Mega Drive game, it's going to be one of those Let's Plays where my commentary gets worse and worse as I go through the game. Because I've got to do it all in one sitting. So yeah, that's that one. And we can uh, now retrieve the Red Gem. Here is the Red Gem. You have much more to do to save Mini. Well, not much more, because this game's rather short. So uh, yeah. See, and let's uh, wrap up the score. Let's see how we see how well we did. Yeah, so I'll push pause when we start the next level. I'll give you a glimpse of what the next, what's going to be in the next video. So it might entice the viewers. You might think, oh, the toy level. Well, I'll watch that. So I don't know. So that's that one. The door vanishes. So another door. What could be inside? Well, let's have a look. We're in the kiddies room. Right, so let's push pause and uh, so yeah, that's the end of this video. I'm gonna cut you off now. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.